Uh, yo yo. So, we're doing a new campaign today. There's a little bit of health fix, but I didn't, I didn't think it actually did anything for the new patch. It's kind of good starting a new campaign when there's a new patch at least. So, we're gonna do uh, a new one. A kind of a semi first today. Yes. Life mastery. Thank you very much for the prime. I do appreciate it. And welcome. So, uh, I command here. Thank you very much, though. Appreciate it. Oh, everything helps. But yeah, we're doing something new today, or new-ish. I did play a tiny bit of Slash before, and I decided that these guys are meant to be played on Immortal Empires. So I did try a little bit, but I didn't do anything really. But we're doing uh, Nakari. Or Nakari. How we actually pronounce it. So... I barely have no idea how this is gonna go. Um, but we're probably gonna put everything on anyway. We'll do our standard... Uh, I think we do everything this time. Because um, I kind of want to see how we do against like dwarfs and stuff. I have no idea if uh, Slash Steam rolls fast, since I barely played it. But we do 40 to 60. Seems like the huge Or we're starting off with. And I have very little clue here what actually to do with Slanesh. I know they're melee focused and I have no ranged and we can seduce stuff. That's basically it. I don't even know how the um, Vassal stuff works. <laughs> I never did anything with it. But I, I have a plan. I don't know if it's going to turn out well or not, but uh, I have a plan. And includes a lot of vassals. I don't know actually how long it takes to um, even get to confederation status with them. Or if it's just going to be us uh, basically murdering everybody. Yeah, the new uh, new UI too. I think it's the first faction with the uh, pink UI. Will you save the tastes of ecstasy with me? I heard a lot of people liked playing uh, Nikari though. So, that's good at least. Oh my god, we're starting with good wins of magic. Uh, does look like he has a buff up here too, with high wins of magic. Uh, why aren't you showing me this? Oh, he has the same as everybody, other demon basically. Movement and speed. Hmm. <laughs> All your vassals hated you. My yeah. I'm not sure what we're doing here. Oh, you guys got war shrines now. The cultist dudes. Slee. That doesn't seem like a very bad trait for Slash. It's very little percentage though. But it doesn't feel like super bad. I guess discipline will always be better either way, but... I feel incredibly bad, at least. So, what does the War Shrine do to you guys? I don't actually know. Keeper of Secrets. Ooh, did he get the new Chaos Ponies? I think they do get the new Chaos Ponies. Or, Deeds. How to vassalize somebody? So apparently, if we get enough influence, I'm not exactly sure how it works. It's this thing here. Uh, you can spend spend it to instantly vassalize them. Let's see. It's actually a tooltip here. A faction's seductive influence increases when contact is made with a Slaneshi faction via diplomacy or battle, or via cults. The gift of Slanesh is a high Slaneshi corruption. Factions with high seductive influence are more manipulative and can eventually be forced into vassalage. Only human elves, beastmen factions are vulnerable to uh, seductive influence. So, trading. Trading and stuff, I guess. I barely know myself, but I'm guessing we want to be friends with these guys. And uh, So we have tolerance, but we have aversion. Wait, we have a treaty with Safari? 
Marathi Wasp. knows those two, apparently. I speak for the Druki. Hmm, could almost get a trade straight away with her. Oh, we have a no oh, we're half half seductive influence with uh, you guys. But hard can there be in the single glance? So. Resistant to seduction. 100%. You'll nail it. Welcome, welcome. So to get positive influence with anything chaos related. And to get negative di diplomatic with everybody else. But they also resistant to be seducted. That's a little, a little weird. Osiric. Welcome, welcome. Okay. Do we have anybody else? <laughs> Goldcrag. Oh wait, you are actually still here. I'm listening. That pretty wants to trade, kind of. our paradise, honored guest. Hundred and seventeen gold. That's probably worth it, right? Uh, cooldown ten turns. Target faction must be fully seduced and not already your vassal. Ten turns cooldown seems a little bit harsh. What would you have of me? He has tolerance, treaties, war with uh, trees, but he has. A, they also have a forty aversion. Hmm. My cult is your cult. Oh yes. Oh, My we don't talk to the sorceress. For souls. Elf player devotion. So, can I see the new stuff? Lower us. Chaos Warriors of Slanesh Hellsguard. There's the new una units. Devastating Flanker on Chaos Knight. It's pretty good. Heart Seekers and Lances. Devoted Marauders of Slanesh. So you're like a slightly better Marauder of Slanesh, I guess. Deep Secret. Four Shrines. Chariots. Secret Chariots. And Red Hunts. Newbie, evening. Fighting dwarfs as Skaven, having a rough time. Which uh, Skaven are we playing, by the way, newbie? Ambush is always a great tool, though, for any Skaven. Squirts the mutant. Give me a thought. What does our tech tree look? What does uh, Nakari's skill tree look like, actually? Seduce. Deeper seduce. Uh, speed and weapon strength. Diplomatic with chaos. Horrific musk attack. I don't even know what that is. Whisper of glory. Rampage. Harvest of souls. This is a weird one with the enemy units destroyed to get super healing. Almost 1% per second. Disciple army. I barely even touched the Slanesh magic either, really. Let's 
It does Megorio. Oh, that's a cut off move thing. That's super expensive. Is it AoE? It is AoE. 22 magic though. 19 fully upgraded. Hidden supply lines, you say? Experience for each new faction is fought. He seduce units 25. That's a campaign effect. Okay. The mortal realm is my Allegiance points. I guess that could be good. Because he could he can have a lot of uh, allies, I guess. What if he can get hellstorms? They're humans, so. Oh, how does actually our economy work? Or so not. How does our economy work? Income generated when below 50. Do you want kind of bad income or bad public order? We can each just check that though. If the thing is actually working. So income all buildings in a region when control is negative. Oh, that's going to be hard to balance. I guess you want to do these two together. Um, that doesn't have a thing. Not corruption in adjacent provinces when control is more than 25. Okay. Do you guys have anything on your buildings? Oh, there's a building just for the Exalted Slaneshi. I thought they were in the same building as the normal ones are. Heal Sorcerer Slanesh Shadow. And Slanesh. Oh, Basis. Welcome, welcome. No, negative. Below 50. Below 50 is where you want to if you get, want to get rich. Which isn't too hard because most of my cities are below 50 almost all the time. Yeah, I guess we just try this out then. Submission. They still have increased mobility out. Do they have a hero with replenishment now? That's actually pretty important. They did get the Chaos Sorcerer now. I know they didn't have a replenish hero before. Scouting. Okay. And uh, Dolores. Training. Of course. Yeah, okay. So no replenish hero. Okay, um, Hell's Riders. Which tier of Cav is that? I have no clue. That crappy tier? Yeah, that's crappy tier. Seekers is the good ones. Hell Flayers? Seems like pretty mediocre tier 2, right? Hell Flayers. Where are you guys at? Eager chariot. Oh, actually, they're tier four units. Okay, so they're the next best. Potemo, welcome, welcome. Dictats. Oh, they have the same thing here. Oh. Oh, it costs control to do it. Recruitment calls. Gives control? That one costs control. This one gives. But it costs devotees too. I don't know if you're gonna have a shit ton of those. That's not bad to 50 growth here. I could li let you steamroll your cities pretty fast. Control and growth. Mm. 
I actually didn't see that. I actually missed this completely. I had no idea. How much does this cost? 1100? How much money do I have? I would love to know how much money I have. If I want to steal anything. Fuck. I don't know. Fuck seducing none. I guess we just go. But you're like, no, I, I completely missed it. I, I haven't played Slanesh before. Like, I just tested them out, like, for a little bit. Oh, you can actually see your own money there? Okay. I'll check that out next battle, if I remember it. Is that, I, that is actually very good to know how much money you have. When you're seducing, so you just don't go bankrupt yourself in battle. And looks like they are in the forest. Yeah, they're probably right in here. I think our gameplay is probably pretty straightforward. Run in, murder. I'm guessing. Not ideal that it doesn't show from what you get get go. Oh yeah, I definitely would have liked like just a money thing like diplomacy has, like in the corner, and like you have this much gold. Would have been nice. He is freaking big. Holy fuck, he's big. I didn't think he was this big. I've fought him multiple times. Like, look at that. Barely even up to the knee. Not even up to the knee. He is freaking huge. I wonder if they will actually be out here. Yeah, I'm definitely expecting it. I'm ex expecting glass cannon everywhere. Like, everything's gonna be glass cannon, I'm kinda thinking, right? I would like them to not to be in that forest, but I think they're all in here. Oh, yeah, they're all in here. Yeah, every single one is in here. Yep, any anti anything? I do have anti something. Anti large, actually. Like, it feels like weird giving them a fully forested map on their first uh, freaking battle. Can't see shit what you're doing. You go hunt that down. With the magic. Do we hearse? No, it's the singletary hearse. Did 
Did you just fly away? Oh yeah. Wait, did you just kill one dude there? Oh no, she's also there. This is dude. 62 Rampage. This hit pretty good though. Oh fuck, he starts at 84 melee attack. That is pretty freaking good. I want to see the heal trigger. Oh, wait, did we have the heal? I thought we had... I think we have one of the heals, right? Or did we get that later? Gold Siphon. Oh wait, do you have a Mortis effect? Wait. Uh... You have a Mortis effect? I didn't even know that. Sixteen to thirty-two damage, thirty-five meter range. Affects allies in all range. Leadership is wave. Oh, it's only if it's lower. Okay, it's only if they're like wavering or breaking. But it was like really freaking scary first. Okay. It's not super useful. That like wavering is just before they're breaking, so that AoE effect probably won't do a lot of damage. Like when they're wavering, they're almost already running anyway. Money, devotees. I'm gonna go with devotees. Two level ups. Hmm. I'm gonna go magic, since we don't have any magic. And it's a good wall casting too. A new way to slay. Okay, so give me the option of taking the capital or the other thing. I'm taking the capital, I think. Yeah, but I didn't have the ability yet. So it was this one, right? No, it was this one, Harvester of Souls. Like this one was upgraded, right? No. I thought it had skill upgraded here, so I thought we had like a shittier version first. Does this actually work? Just get this an army? Is mine. I'm mine alone. 300 though. Proliferate cults. Send your followers into the mortal world. They will establish a cult in up to three human or elf owned settlements. Cults uh, buildings provide various benefits and can allow you to increase your seductive influence over certain factions. That's probably a good thing to do. The three random cities get a cult. I think we can take the big city straight on, right? I feel like we could be able to do it. Okay, so could I see... Okay, so I can actually see how much money I have. I have 6,000. How much do you cost? I definitely want to pick up a couple of uh, archers for this fight. I think that was worth it. Now we just do the fight.
Pretty good tip, by the way, about the money. I would have, I would have been mad about it for a long while before I discovered it myself. How much money I had to spend. Yay. Oh, you actually have one, got one of the good cities too, with towers everywhere. Where would be the least amount of towers? No, you've never been able to spend negative money. You can't spend what you don't have. I don't know where we would go in here. Like, there's so many towers. I guess they won't stay on them. We kind of like going in here, though, because we have a supply point here if we did take it. Get used to it. <laughs> yeah, they've been a little bit lazy with the siege maps, for sure. Yep, they've been a little bit lazy with the siege maps. They do repeat, repeat quite a bit. I thought these guys had Vanguard for some reason. We are in agreement. Okay, so they kept this tower but nothing else. Taste their fear. Faster. They shall act. Uh I have it for minor cities, not for major. Major is subway sieges. I have the 80% chance mod. I like the whip animation, actually. Miss uh, Skulls Jones. It shall be done. That guy should be starting taking damage now, right? He's wavering now. He doesn't take damage from our aura yet. He is wavering. I can't see any debuff on him. Come on. Okay, we're in. I need to try this when they're actually wavering here. The Arion, thank you for the tier 1 sub, but I appreciate it. Hope you're doing well today. Oh, they're going for Nikari, all of them. Oh, 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 you are going really hard for them. What happened to my chariots? Uh, I feel like we need this uh, healing thing pretty fast. Mm. 
Oh yeah, okay, so now it's active. It is actually active now. We can get this chariots out so we can actually do some damage. Well, we're going to re restart too. We're going to need to go in and deal with that Lord too. Okay, they're not bracing right now, so that should be a good charge, right? No, they don't have time to brace here. Look at that damage, though. Holy fuck, that's a lot of damage. Just need to keep them moving now. Chariot to go. You can get it out for another good charge here. He is very poofy though. I feel like we need to get like high levels really, really fast. That's a little bit too chunky maybe for them, or a little bit too shitty charge. So does this still apply here? The musk thing. Poisoned. Okay, that's pretty it's still decent. A little bit scary with uh, Nakari though. He is, like, so good at murdering stuff, though, already. Like, that is very fast for a freaking uh, Lord kill. Could probably done a little bit more with the chariots. I still did, like, 8k damage. Yeah, I think he has zero armor. I think he actually has zero armor. Moment of Discord. Mm. So we actually get these guys from looting and occupying too. I wonder if it's worth getting devotees and taking a little bit of shit public order. I'm probably gonna have to repair the city too, right? I don't know if I have if if I had enough so I could know I could actually occupy and sack, I would rather do that. But I don't think I have. I'm a little bit unsure. A little bit unsure. So we need to get to ten. And then we need to get into this unique stuff. What is the musk thing though? I wanna know. Do I have a unit with musk thing? So I can actually check it out. Okay, that thing's getting destroyed. Uh, we did... Yeah, we got the wrong uh, wrong base, but we'll take that when we upgrade it here too, and we'll switch it. Switch it. Devotees from trading stuff. Okay, cool. Chosen of it. Uh, Mark of Slanesh. No? No, but the Soul Grinder has it. Maybe that's a research. Oh, it's a debuff. It's a good debuff, too. And then, fiends. Fiends have it, too. And uh, let's see, where are the fiends done? Uh, Chaos Bond have it, too.
Who has this debuff? Because this is a good one. Magic and poison. That's a little bit scary on a freaking chariot. Magic and poison. Anti-infantry? How much? 30. Holy fuck, that's a lot. I wonder if this chariot's any good. And perfect vigor for chariot units. This thing looks kind of crazy, but it's only one unit though. It looks kind of crazy. Elfires have 28 bonus versus infantry too. Keeper chain. Oh yeah, they have it there. The budgets change? No. Or not recently. You might got a new one though. You do get a new one on intervals. Keeper actually looks pretty fine too. Wait, I, I don't want to abandon this. I want to repair it. So, how much armor do you have, Nakari? 15. But I think that's one... Yeah, I've got 10 from the island, so he has 5 base. Uh, 5 base. Acquaintance. Um, direct... 20 magic, though. Yeah, the one month, one one month badge is just one month, so it's like a little bit rare, I guess. Hysterical frenzy. It looks okay. I don't really like. It. Does this become AOE? No, greater effect on speed. Increase armor piercing. Has anyone tried this spell? It looks kind of meh. Especially for 16 magic. With infantry? I haven't even checked them. Um, probably yes. Uh, let's see. What's do you write? Yep. A whole zero armor piercing. The shards. The temp. Oh yeah, yeah. Slicing Shards I've actually seen uh, when the AI used them. They looked very good, actually. I'm definitely taking Slicing Shards, but I was wondering here if it's any, like, we want. Like, I'm definitely thinking about this one, probably, yes, or... Like, we need to fill uh, three slots out. I'm thinking these two. This doesn't look too great, the Pavane of Slanesh. I want to get to slicing shards, but I also need to get in here. I want to get at least. Oh, I need to get four points in to get the dis disciple stuff. I I need this one. I think I think I actually need like need need that one. This looks decent. Ling prey. Yeah, I saw that now. I just saw that we had a debuff that is. Technically, just better. I guess I could hysterical frenzy then. Maybe I can take one point in having up slash so you can make some use out of it. Yeah, I'm gonna need one more in here. I think hysterical frenzy looks the most interesting to me. A new way to slay. Increase mobility. Move speed. Drink in my excellence. You don't have a lot of money. You shall summon greatness. Mm, I think we don't want that building, right? We want. Yeah, we want this building. We want this building first. Probably just got a wall here for now. Forsaken. Forsaken of Slanesh actually looks pretty decent. That's a huge amount of weapon strength for a tier 2 units. 58. With Frenzy too. Oh, they're 200 upkeep? How much is, uh, how much are you? Oh, you're also 200? Okay, you're cheap. Your shit ain't cheap. Hmm. 
probably roll with uh... Yeah, I'm probably rolling with Demon Nuts. Demon Nuts seems better for what you pay for them. Any like actual landmarks that are for uh Lanash here? That would be kinda cool. That could be for us, but it doesn't need to be. Oh yeah, we want to get a lord too. I guess I need to... I need to ascend one of these. So traits doesn't really matter, right? Since we're gonna ascend them anyway. So we could just take anything. We could take a shadow lord. I would like to be a lord. You know, you, uh, Nen, you actually survived yesterday if you weren't here for it. You did get attacked by Kemler and you got seven level ups when you won. That's probably the max I've ever gotten on anyone. You got just pure straight up seven. <laughs> it was like very late in yesterday's stream. Yep, I got seven in one battle. <laughs> He went from 6 to 13 in one fight. Okay, we'll get you. D&D &D instantly, Shibo. Are you actually still in... Have you got an... Oh, went home yet? Or are you still uh, in Germany? Here to slay. Okay, researchers. Okay, this looks like a couple of them are locked. Behind the buildings. Temple of Decadence. Okay, I don't even know. Corruption, wheat, sorrow, narcissism. That's a pretty good army buff to get, though. That one. Uh, cooldown on spells. Coronate faction. I don't think we need to care about that. Upkeep income from looting. Income from sacking, that's nice. Oh, you can get income from anything. Seduction budget. Use unicorns is probably going to be very good. Uh, pleasure will act. Uh, Bro. Altist calls. Construction calls. This seems like pretty good, all of it. Your action for cultists, activities, and gifts and slash. That is the this was the bugged bug tech right at release, but it, but it probably working now. Because this seems pretty good now. If that is actually working with the gift. Getting 25 per mark. You can have a lot of marks out. You're home? Bye bye, stupid. No water, only paper toilet. Liter of beer being cheaper than five liter of water. This looks like something we want to unlock like really fast. Because of this, mostly, too, though. Oh, there's the musk, by the way, for the warriors. So it's a tech. There's a tech to give uh, chaos and marauders uh, the debuff. Uh, Slash corruption increased by one all cult heroes, hero actions, six percent. Allurus, forsaken soul grinders, demonet upkeep and demonet strength. War Shrine, Heart Seekers, Knight. There's some upkeep production at least. Give a T upkeep for Disciple Army. This looks like really good too. 
Oh, you even get the Pavane spell? Hysterical Frenzy. For, oh, for Keeper Secret. Spell and Spells Lightning Charge, Keeper of Secret. Agoria. This is just Keeper of Secret stuff. Whole freaking tree for just Keeper of Secrets. Welcome, welcome, Andy. Yeah, it doesn't like seem like this is the only like tree that is devoted to just one unit, which is I guess kind of cool. Ah, uh, there's very little that buffs actual units though. Like there's one technology for demonettes. There's one for knights. There's like one technology for each unit and nothing more. That's like kind of rare. I think we probably start with this. Maybe? I kind of like this though, also. Like, this is kind of nice, the upkeep stuff. So, how do we get Temple of Decadence? What is the Temple of Decadence? Can I search here, actually? No. Temple... Oh, there it is. Okay, it's a tier 3 building. Which I'm gonna build anyway. Okay, so that's gonna be automatically unlocked. Okay, cool. Okay, yeah, choose uh, research. Um... Oh yeah, we can't get anything I actually want right now. That's 6% upkeep there for everything. Reduction. So we need all of them to get to the last one. Pleasurable acts, 30%. That seems like a good one. I, am I guess this is a pleasurable act, right? So that should reduce that cost quite a bit. And probably the this one too, right? Lord. Maybe not. Maybe. Oh yeah, we have unholy manifestations. All the units will take 6% damage, move, speed, weapon strength. For 6 turns. Yeah, that seems good. One man's pain is another's like we're sitting healing anyway, so... That should be fine. Yeah, it seems like a worthwhile buff. Pleasurable acts are settlement actions. Okay, then I'm gonna skip. Is there anything I actually want here, then? I'm gonna go for that hex, then, I think. Maybe. Or the seduction, maybe. We're gonna do sacking, I think, then. We're gonna do sacking. If if that is not actually the cult thing, I'm gonna do sacking. Paint it purple. Paint it purple. Pleasure 
is wasted. It is nice that we have a shipwreck here too. That's 5,000 to just go in there. Uh, so you kind of just hate me. Yes, you do. I'm sure your little message will be most interesting. 1,300. Let me imbibe your essence. Taste the flesh. Yes! Most then, get here. Souls. <laughs> okay, I'm a little bit considering we're probably just gonna go right side rights and just take everything over. It seems like a fair, fair thing to do. I don't have all the money. It's also going to be a siege. I don't think I want to take any of their archers, even though if I wanted to, like... I don't have enough money to spend it on getting one archer here. I feel like that's going to be very... very... not worth our time, maybe. Worth taking it. want to go in here probably a good area to go in Death through sensation. What if we can just roll around with you here? I was kind of hoping we could just roll around with you guys. Send in the Marauders here, maybe. Almost a Nakarian here. For the main. There's a tower there. Have I actually fought on this map? I don't know if I have. We can put a similar green skin map, but. already getting like super focused here aren't you yep oh fuck he's getting like focused not even funny how freaking focused he's getting Getting a little bit choked there. 
How are you boys doing? Finding fresh souls. He recovered in there. Where are you connected to? It's terrible. Before I get back here, I think you guys need help most of all here. their agony that was a very freaking weak charge holy shit that was a weak ass charge oh they're split up that's why okay at least the whip is doing good better one in here. That's a flying charge. Should be good. I guess her packed a little bit too much, maybe. Yeah, I think if we can get that heal, at least we'll make Nakari not be able to just move away. 6,000, 7,000. Still, it feels like the chariot is doing rather poorly when I look at it, but it still makes like 7k damage. It probably... I guess Nakari is the only one who actually out-damages it. Yeah, and a card did 13k, so. Ooh. But I don't actually want that. But that's a lot of freaking devotees. That is a lot of devotees. The Tempter Lord. Yeah. But we did get the devotees here out of that, which is the important thing. You're seven now. Your attack is pretty damn poor. 40. It looks like I can afford one more. One more demon out right now. Then we're capping on money. We could get two more orders though. I guess. Maybe it's worth getting two more orders instead of. Yeah, he's, he seems really fast. I think if you can get the Strider banner, it's probably going to be even better. This will be most enlightening. Do we have? Oh, we have viable territory here, actually. High Elves and Dark Elves. We can't really draw the sword either, right?
construction calls, the government buildings, control, row. Yet they won't grow, though. What can we do with these now? Like, these guys were definitely taking over. They're just neighbors, so you're, you're going down. You guys are going down. After we've done our little uh, sea battle here. Sure. How's our garrison? Mm, not bad. So we get the portal next. We get the portal, we can get rid of this building and we can always get the units we want anyway. I do feel freaking poor though. That's the uh, truth. I do feel freaking poor. So that is a 5,000 gold in there. With a relatively decent battle, I think. Make sure we get Nin in here too. I think that should be close enough for Nin to. Oh, shit, your boat is huge also. Yep, we got Nin in. Good. Ooh. Death guards. Two of them too. Full of guns too. But this should be the perfect opportunity for us to try out our chariots. Against trash zombies. Like they have basically no mass and you can just plow through them. I remember it's like it should be like a blender. I don't even know what I'm gonna do with all my freaking marauders, so. I guess you're just gonna eat stuff and die. Okay, you're there, you're there, you can join in here. I'm guessing Nakari is gonna be like the main target again. The only thing we don't want to hit is these guys. They went that Death guard. Let's just go in here. Oh yeah, it worked like I thought. Holy shit, it worked exactly like I thought with the chariots there. Whoops. Yeah, those chariots are just going right through it. That's bad though. Didn't have enough speed there, I think. The depth parts in here. You guys there. Little bit hard to get in there. Now 
went pr fairly okay through the death guards too. Okay, we're good there. Let's see how much the Darius did. I think they did quite a bit. 14k damage. That's not bad. And we didn't even get, like, we got really good charges at the start. Like, those were amazing when we just plowed through three zombie units. But yeah, these look good. If you have the time to micro, that is, at least. Give them a little bit of micro time and they're pretty much doing what they should should be doing. 133 devotees. Um we can refine this too. Quite a bit. I I desperately need freaking money though. We're just taking that money. Oh we got extra. We got the no item but extra money. Okay, that's a, that's a good start. No, one more. Okay, so we need one more level, so we're gonna save these level ups for the unique shit. Most privileged of Slanesh. Just boost up our full magic here too. Depravity reigns. My deepest desire granted. Ambush it would be great for us as Slanash. He seems to be doing very great. That would be like perfect to deal with most of the freaking high elves. Next turn we got... Oh yeah, I forgot about this too. 2,100 devotees to get 50 growth and... Oh yeah, maybe we should have done that. Um, recruitment, calls to rank, income from all buildings. Why did it have to cost money? I guess I did get a big haul from the thing. Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll pop that up. Bless your party! Let me your okay, I want to see where they have their armies. There's one there. Divine immortality. Spreading seduction. Seventy percent chance here. Onwards. Seeking sweetest agony. Next destination. I don't know Magic if that lord could speed. actually reach us. Gladly. You have defiled the Phoenix Court. Speak quickly. Like that would be a great one, and then we just take the city afterwards. We can even sack it since it's tier two, so it doesn't matter if we sack it. Get the wall here in you. Behold the black court. Few see its splendor and live to tell as you say. Okay, so now we're getting what? Diplomacy plus twenty. Total. Okay, so you have to get three hundred points. 
does this go up every turn or is it just every new thing we do with you Morathi, I speak for the Druki. What is it you desire? I'm not gonna pay you for that. Maybe I am actually. Enter and speak. For time is a luxury. I could join the war against people. you. Oh, you don't even want that. Okay, we're getting the trade just so we have it. Naturally. We got a little bit of boost in money, so. Once it's easy to get before she gets strong or something. Okay, so we should level up to 10 next turn, which we'll see unlock, right? Excellent. Yeah, for some reason Nakari has 10 where everybody else has like 12. The Lord of Excess reigns supreme. Let's see, they should want to go for her, I think. It should be enough distance here. I hope. Oh yeah it is. 70% here we come. Mm. The influence goes up per turn not just one. Good. That's very good. Okay. You don't want to seduce anything. Like it feels such like like kind of bad mechanic right now, but I can get it later when it's uh, when you have a little bit more to play with. But it's a really useful thing to have, I guess. Do you cost different if you have ranks or not? No, you don't. That will use a thousand here to get one archer. Makes the battle easier, but uh, I don't think I need it. I don't think I need it. Let's go. Um, uh, give me a sec though, I need to run to the bathroom. Back in a minute. Oh, nice. Okay, back. Who nice? Kobe, 21. Thank you very much and welcome. Hope you like Plushlor. I can't even speak. Plushlor acts. Whatever. Something. English. So far. Riders. So they have their exit just where they spawn. 
I do wonder a little bit on this map though, like would it be better for us to start the chariots on high ground but have trees? Or start on low ground but don't have trees? The chariots are gonna plow through pretty good. Maybe... I want to get you guys from this side at least. Uh, we can throw our marauders on the left. Mm. Enjoy your dance. Mm. I don't know. We'll see what what happens there. I guess. Are you anti-large or anti-anything? You're just armor-piercing, murder damage. Okay, good. Good to know. I guess we'll send the forces up here too. Okay. Oh, they instantly retreated them. Oh, holy shit. 20% straight away. I wish we had the shard thingy now. I wish we had the shard thingy right now. So, thank you very much for the prime. I do appreciate it. Where's the chariot thingies? I need them. Good. Come back here. So, I don't know if this is too much for the chariots. I guess we can deal with all the archers first, maybe. Oh yeah, did you get the new Chaos Horsey, by the way? Yeah, you did. So you actually might fight pretty good on that one. I need need to actually see how good you're fighting on that one later. Oh, I missed a charge. It went right through though. So let's see if you can go into these guys. Yeah, it's definitely a little bit thicker here. They stop pretty fast. Archer them. Most guys are dying. Those little chariots go. You're done there. You're probably gonna rally. Oh, hello. Welcome. Welcome then. Uh, Hellstriders. What are you fighting right now? Oh, are you fighting archers still? Spears there, though. Let's see. Yeah, pass is really good. I like the passive for Slanesh. Passive is definitely very good. I think I will like slicing shards too. Flag here with you guys. Yeah, it's a little bit too thick here, probably. Mm. 
Sakara Dark Elf? No. The demon. I don't know exactly who he is, actually. So I don't knew, know too much about his lore. Okay, I need to see if you actually got the new fighting animations on that horse. Do you have the new shiny Chaos fighting animations on that horse? Just look like you have the horse at least. Oh yeah, you do. Okay, good. You'll actually be good on that horse song. That G uh, lump, uh, jump leap is uh, one of the new animations. Okay, that should give us the point we need. Get to uh, our unique stuff. 14,000 again on the health layers. And I didn't even think I played them that well. Yeah, I, I didn't even think I played them that well, really, but I do want to check it out. 200. Okay, I'll take the devotees. I want to get 1,000 so we can get some cult things going. All souls will Master. Your search for the blade lost in the Sea of Dreams has borne fruit. The prize is close. Recover the sword before the hated elves of Ulthuan realize what you seek. Oh, hello, Star Dragons, Sisters, and Phoenix Guards. Oh yeah, that's just an easy army there. That resolve almost win. Holy fuck, I've never seen a quest battle with full red bar. Okay, that's gonna have to wait a little bit. Okay, 11. You got enough. Coming prey. Harvest of souls. Musk is probably pretty good. Get one more. Negative corn corruption. Just corn corruption, nothing else. Just corn corruption. I am enlightened. Okay, let's switch to the dimensional breach. Most privileged of You've got a steed. Uh, Calcing I can might not be like too bad for Flash, the ten percent speed. I usually skip this most of the time while casting. Uh, let's get the movement on you then. I usually do it for most factions that I play. Like when I play the Empire and stuff and have Shadow Mages, I usually skip it. I never felt like it was even worth it. Or, I skip it until I don't have anything else worthwhile taken. Because you are gonna get full. Or if it's a Lord. The I feel like the 10% speed it does a lot for most of the... Uh, Armies when you have a shadow caster. Okay. That's a lot of archers. Full spears too. So now when we murder something, we'll get a heal, right? Yeah. For twenty-one seconds. And that would be that's like a 15% heal rate ish. 15, 16% heal. Your 
Oh, remember us when you're chasing a shadow, you nuts? You know, if I remember that I actually... <laughs> Kobe, how you doing? Thank you for the 10. I do appreciate it. Thank you very much. But yeah, if I actually remember that I actually have shadow magic to buff my units while chasing down a shattered unit, I would be surprised. I would be surprised. Long time no gif, I'm late. No worries, dude. No worries, dude. I do appreciate, appreciate it, but you really don't have to if you don't want to. I do appreciate all the support, but... Just because he once did every month. <laughs> French invasion. Even the lawmaster could not. I guess we got a couple of archers. How much money do I have left? At 10,000. We got two archers. I got three, right? Not three. Not three. Crushing defeat. Actually crushing? Okay. That's pretty bad. Oh, it's not the ad oh wait this is not the map we fought on before is it better or worse for us mm. this is the orc map or at least when i did it i'll scale welcome welcome being the first tractor enthusiast of the day too I've, I, I, I remember this is the orc map. Maybe it was a Kisla map first. Oh wait, is it... I remember this is an orc map, but maybe there's a Kisla version of this one too. I don't remember. Holy fuck. <laughs> Those Hell Striders. They're freaking going almost 90 degrees up here. I didn't even know you can deploy here, but I guess you could. Okay. Nice, I guess. <laughs> I'm gonna start there. Fuck it. I want to see if they can actually get up there. <laughs> Gravity overrated. It is. Hey, you guys are not going to do anything. I'm going to send everything in here. Really, but... Um... Yep, yeah, let's just send the marauders in and do whatever. Uh, okay. Did you actually do anything with those health striders? Okay, good. This hex here. Is that an AOE hex? Take the units one. Okay. Not an AOE hex. Oh, 
Holy fuck is such an arrow magnet. This is running in like a short duration there too. God, you're getting murdered so hard just by getting up here. My poor little archers. Okay, you're in. Everybody in. No, no, no. Fuck, I should never docked. I hate this. Go through the freaking gate. I hate that so much when they don't go through the freaking gate. I don't want you to be exhausted and freaking... Ah, that's so dumb. Can't you just go through like a freaking open gate instead? Like a normal unit? This might have been a mistake, by the way. Might have been a mistake. A lot of archers here. Can you guys get in fast now? Don't be stupid, please. Where's my chariots? And get here. And he kills something. You're you're getting murdered by that cab. You're being stupid, of course you are. Why wouldn't you be? You just see the freaking archers just going for it. Any materials? Get here. You can get them to enrage. Good. I'm in melee. Stop fireballing me. Freaking rude, dude. those guys now instead of course it did. God damn it this is super AI freaking focusing though. Charge. Shit. Another fireball there? Not good. Okay now we need to get that heal from you. Okay, you guys need to murder that. Kill it. Okay, good.
tempter. I shall act this. Half of them are still stupid here. Like, even the archers went up here. It's all full and the gate is freaking open. God damn it, that's dumb. Never put freaking ladders up, ever. Murder that unit just to get the thing down. Almost chariots you. Another one here in the last bit. Okay, which is the you archers here? Can you murder them? Here they go. No, that's not you. You right? Re what? You're out there. I guess no heal for us. Oh, you did actually trigger it. I think you did trigger it. <laughs> 88,000 army upkeep and still 16 income. Do it with fewer models, yeah. But it's all pretty damn stupid sometimes. I do it's okay. Like when I sent the two archers in and one of them went to actually go up on the ladder where there was no one in the gate. I just never put the ladders up instead. 2000 tickets. Then got a little thing. Okay. Got a chariot. The temp. Nine hundred. Eh. Hope the divinities from it at least. Hunger for souls. Mm, I want to get slicing shards. Yeah, but I want to get that for you. Fuck it. When hiking on work, they know I have. Gotta use them. Trust Replenishment us. is piss poor, though. Divine immortality. It will be drenched in bodily fluids. I guess we're gonna have to rely on money for trade. Trade should be pretty good for us when we get some resources. We just need to get there, really. Right? So, control, income. Did you actually build a wall? Oh my god, you actually built a wall. The fuck, dude? You actually built a wall. That's gonna be probably harder than this city, though. Maybe hit his roster. But you do have more stuff now with the last DLC introduction. You do have more stuff. But I haven't really played them before either, so. I am incredibly oh, we have a cult here. State your business. We have a cult here. I'll get I'll of take course. that one gold. So, oh, oh, you start with a cult here? 
Temporary dip diplomatic relation bonus for disarmament owner. Seductive influence plus 3 when income is 300 or more spent. When income is 300 or more. Seductive influence. Oh, we get. Ah, uh, okay, that's kind of cool. So we get 6 per turn. We're at 61%. Resistant. Number of settlements, negative three. So the bigger they are, the more resistant they are. Okay. Do go on. This will be most enlightening hmm i'm wondering if we uh how we're gonna make our vassal stuff here really have to choose one of the elves only to just make them our vassals the perfect prince prevails courtesan of the pleasure god we do get access to a lot of trade stuff here though we have Timber first and salt, like in our first two promises. Let's hope that I can actually make up for a little bit of cash that we're currently not having. Port. Disciple army size 20%. But what this determines our disciple me. army? Is that Nakari's army who determines how big our disciple army is? Masters. Great master. So. Ibrestus. Ibrestus capital only has two now. And note. They removed... didn't they have clay or something before? Or marble? They had some, some trade resource that wasn't pastures before. I guess it's easier if you're playing Eltharian yourself, you don't have to deal with their garbage. How much corruption you're in when it pops has an effect. Okay, so we should probably... if we want to pop an army, we probably want to go back here then. Since we're getting up there. I'm kind of looking at this now because I realized there are four turns for building a settlement and this might not, not actually been a bad idea. Marble. Yeah, I know he had something good. One man's pain is another's pleasure. I can actually get to that city and take it out Even now before he gets more garbage. And I, I can't even sack it actually. I can if sack. Oh, it's a good sack though. 2,000. Okay, more archers. Oh yeah, we have pain and pleasure this turn too. I guess we should use this. Then. I think we're destroying this building and uh, now, probably. Because we are getting demonets from the base building now instead. Yes, yeah, so we can get demonets from the base building. That building no longer has any purpose for us. It doesn't do anything but give us marauders. So we can get another growth building in there, or a money building, even. Oh, it's the money building. It was some weird stuff. 100 income. That's still pretty worth it for 900. It's not an expensive building to build, so... Book Valkyrie, how you doing?
We actually trigger it also here, currently. No, wait, negative 50. We're just about not triggering it, right? Yeah, we're just about not triggering the income. Oh, corruption also affects how much we can seduce. Or the budgets. Can see it works out. It was fun. I, I like playing village, but maybe I don't know if his campaign is any. Like I guess you're fighting Cathay, right? You start if you're playing in more vampires. Well, that's a lot cheaper now. Nine hundred only for you guys. And I had, yeah, I could take two. Maybe I should take in a sea guards, actually. Mm, yeah, I've seen that. In our Gravengore campaign, uh, we had uh, we was an alliance with uh, with Village, and uh, Orkian attacked him as well there. Craving. Okay. I shouldn't have taken so much damage on the freaking chariots. Because our replenishment sucks. We just send everything in on the same side. Probably good with that. Could send you in somewhere if there's a forest we can hide you in. Kinda, yeah. Doesn't count as a forest, apparently, though. Don't see any tree symbol. Nope, doesn't count. Just want to hear though. Does it even matter if we put you here though? Can we do anything with you there? We can't go in here, I guess. Marauders take the first hits here before we run in with anything else. For duty! Quickly now! Swiftly! Time! Charge! Do my nets! Of course! Endless craving! The Eternal Hunter! Guided by hunger. On the hunt! Unleash power by the Hell Forge. Onward! We shall act this. Archers! You're actually solo there. Let's go with the chariots that way then. Bring us a joyous decoration. 
You should be able to just deal with that, I think. There's two on that side. Yuri Dilla got like half your units on the other side, so not allow me to charge. Cool. dealt with that that's good and we I guess we can cap this now with you guys should be fine car is still getting like super freaking targeted by something I don't even know what it is is there a character here that we can kill Oh, there's an arch. Oh, you went out to kill your archers here? Like, look at that. What the hell kind of move is that? Just actually going out to kill you guys? side. I would like to kill her if I could. You get the car out there. I think we're winning now, but I really want that kill. Another arc mage. The only thing. Maybe I could actually. Let's see if we can trigger it on you guys. There's only like a few of you left here. Here is you guys shattered. It should be pretty easy to deal with that, right? Okay, there we got the heal. Nice. I'll see if we can actually get a double heal done. I don't know if it's worth getting it, but... Forest is guys ridiculous? Yes, he is. Forest is pretty ridiculous. Why is he going like away that much? Can I do rampage on myself? Hundred and thirty attack. <laughs> there we go. Hmm. I know how useful this is. It's a good heal, but a little bit hard to trigger sometimes. It's got a wide load. <laughs> Big turning radius.
I don't know if this was a mistake. Oh, Forbidden Rod. Very nice. Here regard. Most no, we could actually get it. Okay, we're good, Herodon. We will drive you out. The Tempter Lord. Okay, let's get some magic. Lightning shards. A gift from my master. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Most privileged of Slanesh. A tool of sweetest torture. Okay, let's see what we have uh, gear wise here now. Sort of battle, Forbidden Rod. I don't know if I want that on you. It's better than Earthing Rod. Don't know if I want that on you. Monster Painter. Upkeep for Marauders and Marauder Horsemen. Battle with a Marauder unit. Reinforce a battle with Slanesh. Hmm. Not bad. We're already full magic. Oh, we're full magic on both, actually. Okay, let's just start uh, being... Oh, wait, we don't actually have to do traits on you. We're gonna be get replaced by demon anyway, so... I feel like we need, you need the um, rock marcher and shit. So I want to do a devotee army to see. They're free, right? Devotee's army are free. I remember it. I want to see if that could be worth like having. I might want to save up for the cult still. Yo, Kredo. Welcome, welcome. So you went, how much did you went up this time? You went from 61 to 65. You're relatively fast. Mama Marathi, let's see what you're doing. What? I speak for the Druki. What is it you desire? Yeah, someone said that before, that they have like a hidden little bit of supply mechanic, but they're supposed to be free, right? They, they're they still probably going to be useful, even if they have a little little bit of a hidden supply mechanic. They're still going to be very worth having, I think, still, either way. If not just for defenders, like, you could have a... Like, it's something with, like, if they have high corruption, you can basically have them forever, so, like, having them as a base defender would be a good option. Like a very, really, really cheap base defender. So a little bit of upkeep and income from stocking. I feel like that's probably going to be a worth one. Uh, seduce, temper, stun, cheaper. Seems like a good one too. If there's nothing else we want straight away. I do want that though. Like a lot. Shall 
I don't actually know. Someone mentioned like there was some some sort of uh, supply cost to uh, devotees. Where we want to go. Ooh. Okay, maybe we go up and check some mysterious islands and stuff. Yes! Oh, money and favorable winds. Set sail. Patience. Patience. The exotic sea. My den of sins, to my chamber of pain. I must I was kind of hoping for the uh, building cheaper and stuff, that would be nice. Or the growth, I think there's a growth buff too from the events here, if I remember it. I'm considering having Eltharn as a vassal, because he's he has such a small, small, small city. I do kind of want to try it out a little bit. Like, there's nothing worthwhile in uh, in Eltharian zone. It's a just a very small two zoner, and it could be kind of worth it, right? I'm gonna have regrowth here before I get anything else. Wait, before I build, let's see if we get the construction thingy. Another favorable winds. No, it's upkeep. Okay. So he hasn't taken out the green skins here yet. That means he only has these two. So if we we wreck this or take it, and then we just give him Tory Res, seems like a good idea. Upon strange tides. With joy. Okay, so he has at least two armies. Bring Azurian's fire. Who will join my rapturous odyssey? Can't get any other units yet. Yeah, you always get the wrong portal. We can get you out, murder you a little bit. We'll take Charlena, and then we'll uh, we'll vassalize you when we take Tori Bress. I think. And we'll get a vassal, see how that works out. I, I am a little bit wondering how, like, if they're actually gonna join us. A lot of negative with you guys. Are you on the portal? Because you can get, uh, you can get, uh, demonets in the portal. Uh, the portal has demonets, uh, re uh in recruitment. Plus, the portal gives, uh, AoE slash corruption. So I kinda like it, just to have a little bit extra Corrupting power. It's not a lot though. If they have like, but when you get up to tier three, it's four, and a four actually starts to uh, be pretty good. It's also cheaper military buildings, while this is cheaper infrastructure. So the only difference here is what you get: AOE corruption, and this is infrastructure, while this is military. You also get three growth, uh, three control here, and you get no control here. But a tiny bit more growth, so it's like a small difference between them. But I like the AoE corruption. My it's a good, uh, good one to have. Yes, yeah, so I think we go for it. Sorry, I'm always try to vassalize him just for fun, to see how it works out.
Okay, Alariel's getting close, I guess, since you lost your armies. We're gonna have to go deal with her at some point. You did raise the Phoenix Gate. I really hope you can actually recruit some stuff and fight. I do have a wall here. I'm gonna go greed, I think. Negative 43 stopped on. Get another tier 3. Get tier 3 next turn. That growth commandment is freaking good, by the way. They're growing super fast. Is sitting. Uh, he must be here too, right? Hand maiden of dark. The Fang Sword hungers to meet your neck. I must. I must. Slaneshi wins. For souls. Okay, you can just reach there. Oh, you're doing tier 3 and Tori rests. I guess you haven't been fighting a lot. Or you have been fighting a lot. Oh, she's fighting Safari now. They fought something here. Okay, maybe we have a little bit more time with Lilariel. Mm, don't know. I'll, I'll think about that one for a while. Business. Oh, Slash has done a great game. So what does it do now then? 12%. That is very interesting. 12% buff for everything. That is a very freaking good buff. Take 6% six, 6 damage though. Wait, we don't get trade resources for lumber? What we get for fur? Why? I guess I got money then. I guess, we need... I guess all, all is probably kind of nice getting up there. That's weird. Can't even tell if that's intended or a bug? Uh, yeah, me neither. Probably a bug, though. But I, I'm pretty sure we're supposed to be able to get trade resources, as you guys. Defensive Alliance, you say. Military Alliance. I don't know if this is something I want, actually. Be just taking myself.
this something I want? Like, you're most likely dead either way. Wits isn't real. I'll think about that. I'll uh, just give me money instead. I'll take the money instead. I do give you military fail. access and I'll give you... And give me money. I'll think about the rest. All souls will yield for Slanesha. Okay, so Altharion. What Slanesh happened here killed. and where is your army? There's I that army. Okay, we're taking out your Sedaton. We're taking it out. I want to get the Altharian straight because I can't remember if it's good. I remember it was okay, I think. I can't ex remember exactly what it was. I'll take an archer. Yeah, I'll take an archer. Bon oh yeah, I actually do want that then. I definitely do want that. Expert charge defense is nice. And bonus there is large too. Oh, he does still have his unique map? I was kind of wondering if he had Tori Vers map still. Or it doesn't look like the same one as the other ones. So Tori Vers still has this unique little map. There's one beach map that is still like relatively the same. This is actually one of the I thought I think was okay maps in Warhammer 2. Like it was definitely okay this map. It's a lot bigger and It wasn't really a good map, but it was an okay map. Like, this was more more like it. Uh, looks like a oh, kind of okay defending it now, too. You can build blockades here and here. And you can even defend this. Which also has access to two towers and two barricades. Missile resist, that's even better though. That is actually even better. Missile resist is probably better for Nakari. <laughs> From what I've, I've felt so far. Hmm. Yeah, I got all the DLCs. That's still a pretty decent trade to get her up. Of the There's only really one path we can even go here. Pain and mm, I guess we can throw you guys in first since I don't care about if you live or die. Care a little bit more about you and I care about my demon nuts. All of you, take it slow. Please stop just spreading misinformation.
You're, wait, you're that fast walking? You're actually faster than my shit walking? Okay. I did not think you were faster than all my other shit while walking. <laughs> Akari faster walking than anything I have in the army running. Um, I'm gonna regret this, but I, I'm just gonna get you up there. I don't want them having these... Did you just lock me in? You did, right? Did you just imprison me? Yep, you just imprisoned me. What happened to my slicing charge? Oh my god, that's a long casting time. That is a long casting time. Can you please go into the gate? Let's see if we can trigger that heal on you. Should be too hard, it's only five left. Good. Worked like a charm. No one faster. You still went up there, of course you did. Looks like your charge went a little bit awry here. do very well when you actually get a good charge out. It's actually luck. The only thing you guys left? Look at that. Holy fuck. It's like 45% health gone in one charge. More chariots. I love this doll. Nine second duration. How long cast time does it have? That's five second cast time. Looks cool though. Oh, it actually breaks. Okay. 
Good to know that it has a long cast time, so you can actually line it out a little bit. Okay, so we're probably gonna just murder... If Iltarn is dead, we're gonna have to wait for Iltharion, because I'm gonna get that trait. And then we just murder him a little bit while we wait then. Mm, I wanna sack this. Fencer Blade? Sack the settlement. Master Poet. The Tempter Lord! The Tempter Lord! How oh my god, replenishment is horrible. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. I see. I must taste flesh. I don't see a second army, but he could this have one. Here's mine, and mine alone. Gift of my master. It's corn. We're gonna get the Loris. I, I need an Loris. So that's tier three Loris. He doesn't look like it. Like, he, if he is, he probably sailed around. This is a major capital, so... He, I think he might be down here somewhere, at best. Most privileged of Slanesh. Oh yeah, do I want to do this shit, though? Slanesh. I might want to do this shit. Take a little bit of damage. For a lot of buffs. This is my like it's probably worth it. For twelve percent of everything. All done a hell hole. They do actually, a lot of times they do actually manage to um, to beat Nakari, but it definitely takes them a while. But it's not that too, it's just like their balance is kind of fucked right now. And the AI is pretty weak overall. Like overall the AI is pretty weak. Like a lot weaker than before. Nope. There he is. Ooh. We didn't get an ambush either. I don't know if I win this. That's a lot of nasty shit. That is a lot of nasty shit and a lot of archers. We're gonna have to fight it though. We can't say no here. We're just gonna get double stacked. Um, How much money do I have? I can, can I get two? I get two archers. I wish I could get a bolt thrower too. We were 91 over here. I wonder if it's worth getting the bolt thrower though, maybe. Two archers or one bolt thrower. I'm going over straight away there. Oh, those guys are 2,000. Silver and I'm gonna use magic on. Even though they have this, it's not too bad. I don't think that's gonna be the problem. The range is gonna be the problem. It's only two silvering guards. I 
think I take the bolt thrower and nothing else. We're missing so little to get an archer too. I think I take the bolt thrower. I think that's our best take here. They probably won't move, but we get a lot of damage out of this. We'll get a lot of damage out of that bolt thrower, I think. Because they, they usually camp it up pretty hard. And that means we're going to be getting a lot of value out of the bolt thrower. you have another thing. They don't really follow the Warhammer 2 rules anymore with forced movement. At least we have the high ground or kind of the high ground here which is nice. If I can get the... If I can get around, I think I can do a shit ton with our... Um... With our... Um... Chariots here. Looks like a very good map for our chariots. Like, I don't think they will move until we have done a lot of damage. So that probably means we can set up everything that I want for later. Is that everything we have? It is. I would be surprised if they actually come for us. I think they're just going to camp it out. Your damnation is inevitable. Your musk shall cease. Charge! Yeah, they're just camping it out. We're still gonna use it to our, our full advantage, so... We'll start moving at some point. Are they coming? I think I kind of want to charge in. There's a cavalry. Cost you more damage. Soul Riders! Move! Holy fuck, that did a lot of damage. We are in agreement. Okay, there's one archer there. 
I lost the chariot here to archers. You're still getting focused by something. You guys. Let's get our melee jungle down here then. Okay, that's good. That is freaking good damage there. Where's my why is my chariots being weird? Voltor doing pretty good. I'm gonna get a heal here if we can. They probably won't be coming back here, so San Prazar and to die. It's gonna hope you would be kind of dying here on your own a little bit. Okay, got that heal off there. This will do. Yep, definitely took damage. Definitely took damage. Yeah, I need you to be a little bit more wounded. I want to get the trait on the uh, guy as well. Did you? Oh yeah, you got the heal here. Okay, so that's probably good enough for you. I want to get the Tharion's trait while we have it available for, uh, for Nin as well. Most of the army is dead. He got his bolt throw left. It did 120 kills, so... 21k damage. I think that's probably one of the better choices we could have made. Yeah, you kind of need to be in a building. There's a... There's a building for it, though. That you can get a little bit from. And I think there was a tech, too, but it was a later game tech. And probably supposed to use the, the disciples a little bit more aggressively, maybe. And maybe this, but I'm gonna take the money. I'm greedy.
handle killed in battle. 10% missile charge defense against large. Yeah, that's still a good trait that we want. We still want that trait. Gifts given. That's actually our first gift. So, seduce units, negative 10. Devotees per turn, 5. Uh, Slanesh corruption, 5. And influence per faction. Okay. That's good, though, that we already have that trait on you, if we're forced vassalizing you anyway. We don't have enough still for the devotee thing. The Tempter Lord. I think I want to get Arcane Condit, because I probably want to overcast this at some point. Looks like Slash Magic is pretty solid. I'm gonna say Slash Magic looks pretty solid. That's what I'm saving up. I'm gonna do the cult things and uh, see if we can start spreading a little bit. Because we were, we will be getting three cults for free. Um, I guess randomly between elf and humans. So I'm thinking if I do this, we might get like a little bit here and there that we actually want to go to, and we can start marking them with the uh, um, heroes instead. That's what uh, so I don't, I'm, I don't, that's I'm what I'm doing, but I'm just gonna do it with this instead. Most privileged of Slanesh. Oh, this doesn't give replenishment. Yeah, that's what I've been thinking. I I know the gifts are like you can actually get a. I don't know if we can cult details. We can't see the other cult buildings, but I know there's a cult building that gives you a uh, um, one of these guys. And then we could uh, use her to mark other lords to start influencing them to get cheaper seductions if we want to fight them, or just straight up vassalizing them. That's my plan, at least. Okay, Nin, you want this trait, so sorry. Just sit there. Grant divine immortality. I wonder if I even dare Atris hold us. Like our army is so wounded, and it does kind of matter for us. Yeah, I'll probably play it. So when I'm done with this, I'm not sure if we should go for the green skins too, or if we go up and start dealing with L'Oreal. I think she's gonna be our major, major threat or what do you want to call it? You coming in? Twenty seconds. Onward. Marauders of Slanesh. Striders. Rig victory, yeah, but zombies don't out a well. They play well, but they don't out a well. No one faster. They pay, play well, but they don't out a well. Oh. 
Die. Yeah, I did try. I, I haven't tried Gorst yet, but I did. I did play Blood, so. Double mark. You actually have negative mark head. Uh, negative dots now. <laughs> Twenty three ton. That's a lot of stats for you guys. Oh, he just got his spell off. Like the last freaking second, he got his spell off. Okay, so we have uh, gotten those traits. Cool. Then we just vassalize him and see what we do with that. I did play Vlad. Like the zombies are good at like the zombie. I had like half half my stack when we played vampires with zombies too, and they are still very good, even if you're not playing Gorst. Most privileged of Slanesh. What do you get for mount options? I actually get exalted chariots and stuff. Uh, fist resistant defense, quickness, or debuff. I don't like this one. 35 meters. Also, kind of like this one. This is my. Okay, so we can't actually get rid of you now. It's a very good suck, though. It looks like it can vassalize you the same turn. This is but absurd. most of our army is just barely hanging on there. I know. What do you think about the demon factions in relation to the Warriors of Chaos equivalent? Uh, Chaos is just stupid strong all around though. I like, I like that like these guys definitely needed the DLC. So you actually get the options to get like uh, a little bit more variety in the armies. I The only faction of the demons I kind of liked uh, that was decent was Korn before. They didn't have tons of variety either, but they had more than anyone else. Like, Siege, playing Siege and Kairos was freaking terrible. I loved playing him as a lord, but holy shit, it was pretty freaking bad when you played him as... Um, when you played him... Um, played him uh, just for the... Uh, things. Technology, tech treats have been, they're bad all around though. I think tech treats are pretty much bad all around. For, um, for demons. Or not, maybe not bad, like if you compare it to the Warriors of Chaos tech tree, which I think is pretty freaking good. At least Archeons, which I played. And Village was pretty fine too, it was a little bit more bare bones, a little bit more Siege. Scene structure, I guess, but you got some other stuff instead. 
But I feel like they were pretty good tech treats for the Chaos suits. You got some unit buffs, you got some cool army spells here and there. And um, stuff like that, so... I did kind of like, think they made a good job of uh, Warriors of Chaos. At last, I am a... It's a bit of a little fix-all. Maybe, maybe. Probably no. Not everything, at least. Okay, so I get 3,000 from sacking. But I'm also very wounded and would like to steal something. What if I just not stole anything and went in here and not got murdered, maybe from range? And then I'll be wounded as fuck and I limp back to my own territory after I vassalized them and get some new units instead. I'm not getting tier 3 until four turns, so I'm not getting anything new soon it at least. Because I need to get this building and I need to get this building. On tier three. We get it in Loris and I want to get the technologies unlocked here. Probably get a Hail Soul Sword too, too, to be fair. Like, I personally, when I, we went through the whole kind of tech tree here at the start of the stream. I actually haven't checked it out before. And there's some good stuff, but there's very few unit buffs or, at all. Like, there's basically no unit buffs in this whole tree. There's a whole tree dedicated to freaking, um, um, what are you called? Keeper of Secrets. Like, this, this tree is just for Keeper of Secrets. Maybe that's the thing that you just want to keep a secret stack or something. But otherwise than that, there's only one buff for each unit. And there's... Not a lot of value. Like, I think this is good. I think these buffs are definitely good. But there's... Like, so much weird shit. Like the diplomatic tree here. Which some buffs. I think it's not terrible. Definitely seen worse, and uh, yeah. You have a lot of things to increase experience pretty fast though. I didn't actually mind it, I think it's a very good system. And you can always get um, aspiring champions just from recruiting them. They're pretty common. Like more common than they should be almost. Especially if you have a couple of wasteland territories, like you find them quite a quite often, and you can find trolls and uh, dragon ogres really easy too. They're also probably the most valued units in there. I don't mind the green skin tech. Actually, I think it's it's a little bit little. I would have wanted, wanted a little bit more, but I think the green skin tech tree is a good one. It's a little bit short, and but there's good buffs in there. Uh, and multiple buffs for our units too. I think it's still a good tech tree, but it could have used a little bit more. Armored trolls, I used them in the late game. They're probably one of the best units. You really like the Cathay and then Hendate instantly I hated the Cathay. <laughs> Cathay has a good tech tree though, or some of them are really good, but some of them are just pointless. Mm. <laughs> like I think it's it's not yeah the worst one either really, but um there's so many pointless technologies that you have to do. That basically gives you oh, here you go. 1% of punishment or something. Hmm. But I feel like green skin tech tree is actually a good one though. A little bit small and you can finish it pretty fast. Wouldn't mind to have a couple of more technologies. And there's nothing like... I think... Like both the dark elves and high elves tech trees... Like they have really good stuff. 
but it takes way too long and they're locked by too many shitty things especially high elves too low you have to have this building and this building and this building i think those are all one of the worst ones just because they're locked in I hate when they lock shit behind buildings. Especially when you get to like, what is it, tier f like tier 4 tech or tier 5 tech? Uh, with the high elves and you have to have the upgraded smithy, which nobody uses ever. And then you have to have the grand repository too. And the last one you have to have basically everything at the same time. Like you have to have a fully upgraded dragon lair, and the te technologies take like 10 plus turns, maybe even 12. It's a lot of time just to get through it. It's like when most people are done with the campaign, they're barely halfway through the high elf tech tree. Some uh, chariots here, I think. And you guys come here. Hellstrider. Actually, do I want to go in here? It'd be better if we go in. No, I want to go in here, that's fine. Okay, I need to get in a car here now before he gets murdered by any every range in the game. Wait before you charge on. Wait for that spell to hit. Don't go that way. God damn it! it takes so long. There we go. Now we can go in. You went way hard here on this side. Yeah, they went way hard on this side. Is probably dying. Pain is a gift. Oh, you're shooting. Oh, fuck. They're actually focusing me. Okay. Akari, you need to be a little bit focused here. Shit, I lost. Already lost one. Okay, Akari, come here. Kill my chariot, please. Oh, I can't do an overcast. That's probably still fine.
Are you out? Just take that tower out. Good. I'm gonna need so many turns of redone after this. Staying in there, right? I don't even know if that's worth even trying to save. Okay, we're pretty, pretty wounded right now. And they got another one off just before. Okay, let's vassalize this guy. He's now ours. We need to get back anyway. So the question here is, the Greenskins do hate the rest. Will they bully my vassal now? Will they bully my vassal? Ooh. Maybe just subjugate straight off for the 500. There is much we can teach you. Upon the precipice, this faction has left the temptation of Slamash Lord to them at the very brink of damnation. You may send your dis disciples to attempt to dominate them. Wait, don't I have you dominated? You kind of hate me, right? Yeah, just a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit. The Tempter Lord. The gift from my master. Oh, I didn't even know it. Does it actually make sound? I didn't even know it did. Dancing. Okay. Bit of shade. You got a better army than I just defeated him with. Maybe it's fine. Yeah, you're never gonna want to trade though. You're definitely never gonna want to trade, but we can do this now. I want to see how this actually turns out. Griffin Wood, Eoshafen, and Tor. Where the fuck is this? Oh, we got one in. We got one in here. Behold, Elven Beauty. So let's see. Plus one hero cap for cultists. Cults will be summoned near the summons if capacity is available. Uh, influence per turn. Life law will be summoned near the summon. Okay. Um, where else did we get the stuff? The bio shop, and that's probably fine. Oh, you better not wreck that. And Griffin Wood. Why did we get down here, too? <laughs> Basically, the same place. Oh, it costs devotees to build them? Okay, uh, let's do... Okay, let's do this done. We only do one. Okay. It costs money to build them, but it costs devotees. Okay. So we had a guy there and a or girl or whatever. Magic in purest form. The greatest secrets are mine. I This is actually starting to go 
good public order. Okay. Well, I trade him Tory Russ soon, I think. Do you want to rest out? Like, you could be stubborn, right? Oh yeah, you really want that. You have a lot of money. I could wait to trade it for trade, though. But maybe it's not worth it. Let me just give you to rest straight away. And just take all, all the money you have. My solemn duty. Okay, let's see how this works out. Then. Okay. Uh, so we need to get devotees. A lot of devotees. I feel like that negative building would have been nice. Oh, they didn't actually lose their tier 3 here. Because I just took them. I didn't actually lose their their um pro porter here, which is nice, I guess. Um You like me but you don't like my vassal. A victory soaked in pain. Uh I need to run to a bathroom though, so I'll be back in a sec. 